Please report those who... Perhaps we should return home. Forming a fusion.
It seems that it can gain new power. 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 Choose which skin. Is this the first? Now, let us begin. It seems that it can gain new power. that it can gain new power it seems that it can gain new power choose which Is this the person? Be born anew. It seems that it can gain new power. Choose which is this the per now let us begin. Seems that it can gain new power. Choose which This the first be born anew.
luck be on your side. Focus in your desires. So good. It still hasn't noticed us. Breathe right past Don't turn up your soul. an airship. The view from the sky was truly breathtaking. My legs still feel all rubbery when I walk. I thought it was fun. In fact, I'd like to go again. Hey, knock yourself out. Just save it for after you take down. Now then. <sighs> Doesn't look like there's any shadows around. What the hell's all this? You can do it, Akira! 
bring those villains to justice! There's so many people. What's going on? Oh, are these all the shadows who've had their hearts changed? The great Akira's Hero Show will begin momentarily. Please gather in front of the stage and show your support. Hero Show? By Kanoe? This sounds interesting. Let's go see. No. Take a closer look. The guards are on the lookout. If they spot us, we get swarmed, and then it's game over. We should probably fall back for now. Something like this happened in Sapporo, didn't it? You mean the He Horde? That was mirrored by the huge cleanup campaign in the real world, right? This may be the same thing. Huh, does that mean Kanoe is doing some kind of show in the real world right now? Which begs the question, will this crowd go away once he's finished? We need more information. Maybe we should go back to the real world and see for ourselves. All right, if you think it'll help, we'll head back. Let's see just what Kanoe is up to. Okay, it's time to pull out. Mr. Kanoe. The Emma app developed by your company, Medis, has become immensely popular all around the world. With Japan's creative industries starting to reach their limits, it's wonderful to hear about such a remarkable breakthrough in AI technology. I hear many have high expectations for you as a leading figure in this country, Mr. Kanoe. <laughs> well, I wouldn't say I'm all that. I do plan to do the best I can, though. The world is about to undergo a massive transformation, and I'm hoping to steer it in the right direction. <laughs> oh, thank you. You're too kind. Oh, well, sounds like you've got their support. That reminds me. I've heard that Emma's servers are kept at the Tokyo Radio Tower. But way back when, the Tokyo Radio Tower was used to usher Japan into a new era of communication. Perhaps this time around, Emma will play a similar role and bring us into the age of AI. Yes, that's certainly the idea. As of now, AI is still a fledgling technology, but I've no doubt that it's going to make all of our lives that much easier. And as a testament to that, it's worth noting there were several areas that openly lamented the halt in Emma's service the other day. Why do you think the Phantom Thieves would target Emma of all things? Naturally, Emma holds a vast amount of personal data. Perfect target for a gang of crooks, if you ask me. Or perhaps they're just opposed to my ideas of AI making the world a better place. All that talk about them being champions of the meek and downtrodden is likely no more real than those cheap masks they hide behind. They threaten anyone they disagree with and rob them of their free will if they don't comply. Evil people performing evil deeds. Nothing more. We won't be defeated by some ragtag group of petty criminals. I'm more than determined to battle their injustices to the very end. Mr. Kanoe, you held a press conference the other day and mentioned your distinct hatred for the evils of this world. Might that stem from personal experience? <sighs> yeah. Yes, I suppose you might say that. As a child, I was caught in a rather unfortunate incident in which I lost someone very close to me. I'd wager it was that incident that caused me to harbor such disdain for wrongdoing. However you look at it, I can't allow the Phantom Thieves to continue doing as they please. I couldn't agree more. I think we'd all like to see this Phantom Thieves case resolved as soon as possible. That explains the whole hero show thing. Bastard! Where's he get off with all that shit? Yeah, but he's got a crap load of people behind him. He's trending like you wouldn't believe on social media. Have all those people had their hearts changed too? No, it's not like it was with Natsume. These are just regular old fans. So everyone's being won over by Kanoe's charm without ever knowing what he's really like. His track record with Medis certainly is impressive. Oh, come on! The guy's full of shit! Without knowing who he is on the inside, he probably seems like he really cares about making the world a better place. This isn't much different from what happened with Shido. Well, people do tend to pick the safer choices in life. Is that true? In a life of nothing but decisions, there's always a fear of not knowing what comes next. Without knowing what lies in store, 
people often end up turning to the thing that gives them the best answer. So when it comes down to it, they're more inclined to latch on to whoever's going to make things easier. First it was Shido, and now it's Kanoe. Actually, this might be even worse. Seeing as Emma is a lot more up close and personal with people. But is it really okay to live like that? Leaving everything up to something else? Well, the truth is, not everyone believes in themselves enough to do otherwise. Not like I'm one to talk. But that's why we're exposing the real villain here. So we can bring those people back to their senses. Right. We can't let them change everyone's hearts for their own schemes anymore. <laughs> we're gonna tear down that stupid jail of his, and then I'm putting my foot straight up his... Oh, oh maybe we hold off until we get some grub, yeah? You gotta be kidding me. That certainly cut the tension. <laughs> now that you mention it, I'm hungry too. We were running around in that jail for quite some time. Dinner time! What'll it be? We are in Osaka, so we'd be crazy not to do takoyaki, right? That sounds nice. I've been wanting to walk around and try a little of everything, honestly. Oh, do such flavors really exist around here? I suppose I should have expected as much from Japan's wondrous kitchen. No trip to Osaka is complete without them. I'm actually surprised. Each shop really does taste different. Looks like trying a bunch of different places was a good call. Oh, so this is the authentic Osaka flavor. And best of all, it's affordable. Aren't you gonna have some, Mona? <laughs> it's too hot for me right now. I'll just have some once it cools off. I'm sorry you can't join in with us, Sophia. Well, I am an AI. I'll just have to make do with the data. Don't let it get you down, Sophia. We'll bring some to the jail later. Really? Thank you. Man, traveling around and chowing down like this is the freaking best! Would have been nice if Gramps could have tagged along. He was close enough to make it home, so I think he wanted to go see Akana-chan. She was probably waiting for him, too. I hope they get more time with one another once this case is settled. Yeah, and then Gramps can shower Akane in gifts and treat her like a princess and stuff. There's something I still don't understand. Why did Kanoe bother to create the jails in the first place? Wasn't it because that Owada dude told him to? I don't think that was the only reason. We heard in his jail that he wanted to save people, didn't we? Yeah. One look around his jail, and it's clear that he totally believes in what he's doing. He thinks he's the perfect embodiment of justice. It's true. He does see himself as a hero. Are you suggesting he isn't acting for his own gain? At the very least, he must have his own reasons for taking part in all of this. We'll know for sure once we meet the Monarch face to face. For now, let's just focus on the problem at hand. Yeah, you're right. We'll eat up and get our strength back for today. Well, I'm taking the rest then. As if, like you really need all that. Hey, it's first come, first served at this point. You guys better hurry before I swipe it all. I, Haru Okumura, accept your challenge. W wait I want some too. How's it going? Can I help you find something? Yeah. 
Is that what you want? Stop by again. What will it be? Well, that's what you like. Thank you. What a coincidence. What in heaven? So, it's all see you again. Let's get to work. Let us begin. Just add this. Okay, let's do this. Looks like 
think I've learned another new skill. It's that hero show or whatever's wrapped up. I wonder what it was like. I'm curious. Oh, you want to go see one sometime? We can go to a Featherman show. Once we get in the castle, we're headed straight for the roof. Are you ready? All right, let's go. All right, the coast is clear. Let's make a break for the top. I'm kind of surprised how easy it was to get inside. A little quiet for a castle. That's not normal, is it? I don't think so. I've got a bad feeling about this. This is usually when everything goes wrong. What's this light? It's so pretty. But what is it doing? Uh, whatever it's doing, it can't be good. Intruders detected. Executing forced removal. Wait, is this thing a teleporter? It's a friggin' trap! We gotta bail! Wait, Skull! If you try to leave the circle, you'll get ripped apart? You gotta be shitting me! What? What happened? <laughs> it seems we've been forcibly teleported somewhere. Ugh, I don't feel so good. I think I'm warp sick. What, so we're locked up? Ah, man, I feel like getting caught's all we ever do anymore. We have to get out of here, and quickly. Hey, just try to stay calm. In times like these, the best thing to do is to carefully check your surroundings. The door's open on the other side. I wonder if there's a way for us to get over there. Treasure chest. Let's open it. I can see it. Maybe relevant to my interests. Uh, that shadow looks pretty tough. The RNG gods smile upon us. Your true what are you doing? Not going down without a fight. We're in a good position. You're wide we can open. attack at any time.
look like there's any shadows around. Sprung the trap on us? I guess we should say thanks. Quit resisting and get stalked. This must be the security room. It looks like we can unlock it. So if we... Of course. All right. Take it! 
to regret. Andres, McCoy, Silky, Lamia, Legion, Unicorn, Valkyrie, Unicorn! Rabbit's them! Show them why. Greet our guests. Getting lots of shadow for you here. You guys are just gonna have to hold out.
learned another new skill. It's an elevator. No, we have to go up even more? It looks really high. I can't even see the top. Well, given Kanoe's elevated opinion of himself, I'd say this is part of the course. Yes, we're going up then. We've got to get those desires back. Everyone, look! A birdcage? So this place has one too. Every jail we've seen so far has. But why would Kanoe's jail possess one? Is he not the mastermind behind all this? I don't know. Kanoe is supposed to be the one who created the jails. So he would have to know how they work. It wouldn't make sense otherwise. In which case, the only explanation is that he's trapped himself here with trauma of his own. Why would he do something like that? It could be necessary to creating a jail. Does that mean Kanoe's got some dark past too? A guy that confident? I don't know. Doesn't really fit his image, if you ask me. So what's the plan then? You said we need a key if we want to open this thing, right? That's correct. And we can get a hint as to its whereabouts by touching the birdcage. Come on! Again? No, let me do it. I could use the experience. Good luck. Make sure you don't let go right away. Don't go crying on us, Gramps. Huh? Yeah! Oof. Listen to that wolf howl. I've heard stories of cries that could shake the heavens. Could this be one of them? It's almost operatic. You guys don't even know, man. That shit seriously hurts. Quiet! I hear something. <laughs> Abuse? Please, that's ridiculous. We do have a dog. Maybe that's what they heard? Right, Akira? Hey, whose voice is that? It doesn't seem to be Kanoe's. But he said Akira. Isn't that Kanoe's first name? Whether it was your dog or not, Kanoe-san, we got a tip that you've been physically abusing your son. Apparently, Akira Kun has a scar on his arm to prove it. Look, he fell over. How many times do I have to say it? Are we done here? I'd like to be left alone. You little shit! You see all this trouble you're causing me? Keep your goddamn mouth shut and do as I say! What the hell was that? Kanoe's past. We were viewing the trauma he keeps locked away in his heart. Trauma? There, there. Good boy. Who's a good boy? What am I, a pet? You guys could have warned me about that. Well, it's not like you asked. <laughs> I feel like I've heard that excuse before. Yeah, from yourself. Getting back on track. I heard one of the voices mention something about abuse. Was Kanoe abused by his father? That's terrible! It's pretty messed up, but it doesn't justify all the skeevy shit he's been doing. Indeed. What's past is past. Nothing changes the fact that Akira Kanoe is an incredibly dangerous man who changes others' hearts and robs them of their free will. Right. We've got to stop him. So if being abused is the source of his trauma, then... What exactly is his plan here? Just gonna have to ask him about it. Up close and personal. Yeah, but first, we need the key to the birdcage. Let's head back to the real world and try to find the source of that voice. Hey, Joker? Was Kanoe really treated badly by his own father? Senkichi and Akane were on bad terms. But nothing like that ever happened between them. Why did that happen to Kanoe? Aren't they family? Psst. 
So some humans are just like that then. Joker, do you think family is important? I do too. If I ever get family or friends, I want to support them as much as I can. I learned that from the Phantom Thieves. I wonder how Kanoe must have felt back then. Hey, come on you two, let's get going! Sorry to keep you waiting. Let's go, Joker. <laughs>